So how do they truly feel about you right now? Let's start off with a tarot card. We have the Six of Pentacles. Soul family. The true feelings. Harmony. Let's look at a message card as well. We're going to look at lots more of all of these cards as we go through this reading. I'm pausing to get a better look at things, the hanged man. And this is my truth, the king of swords. So your person, they're feeling very, very supported by you and the soul family, okay? In very profound, deep ways. The hanged man, this is all about them seeing life, love, everything, this whole existence from a totally higher perspective of the fifth dimension and beyond. This is my truth. This person, they are feeling joyful. They're feeling strong and secure within themselves because of you and um, the soul family really helping them to understand who they truly are, them understanding they are this light worker, they are this higher dimensional being. And this is absolutely filling them up with love and joy and self-confidence, self-esteem. You have really made this positive, really positive impact upon them. You and this connection has come in and completely changed their life. This is why we have the hanged man seeing everything, everything from a totally different perspective. Understanding that in this world, it's a lot about inversion, inversion of the truth, a lot of shadow, um, a lot of gaslighting that goes on in this false matrix about what reality in quotation marks is. Your person, this, this connection, you've turned their world upside down and they're seeing things the right way up because they are having this enlightenment. This is my truth. Your person is going from strength to strength with their confidence being much more authentic and this is so much harmony that the Six of Pentacles is a balance of giving and receiving. It normally shows a balanced scale. So this is you feel equally. You love each other equally. You give and receive this love, this energy, this truth. And it is circulating within you both, rejuvenating you, waking you up. Your person, they feel ecstatic, okay, right now. Um, they feel this deep sense of belonging. They're understanding where they originate from, you know, the soul. And they feel so loved, so supported. This is an unconditional love. They bring so much, they feel so much peace. Um, celebration right now a lot of guidance coming in they feel deeply deeply understood by you and there's this powerful sense of home so your person is absolutely over the moon they are transforming so much healing so much this is opening their heart this is allowing them to be more of their true self yeah you've come into their life and created this death and rebirth death of the full self who they thought they were and um, they always had this deep inner knowing more likely subconscious that there's something that they are someone um so much more than what we're told we are in this false matrix so death and rebirth but look they are giving you so much love okay this is someone who's opening their heart to you water in the garden and them offering these sweets here. This is the energy of love. And um, there's all these smiling faces here. Feeling so happy, okay? Your person feels so happy to finally understand who they are, why they are here. You've come in and answered the biggest questions that they've had throughout their whole life. That you're helping them make sense of themselves and everything and understanding what true love is. They absolutely love and adore you. We have the tower. You came in like this bolt of lightning. And look how this crown 
is falling off this tower. That's like the opening of the crown chakra, the lightning is all of this truth coming in. You create these positive tower moments, crumbling things that aren't serving them. Primarily the false perceptions of what we're told reality is. They're seeing the true reality and it's so much more beautiful, so much more powerful than they could have ever imagined. And they're so excited. They're so uplifted. This is them crumbling their walls. This love is healing these fears within them. So walls, blocks, masks are crumbling and they love you completely okay with this King of Cups. There is a lot of turbulence going on around them. The crumbling of the false matrix, um, the rebirth of them remembering who they are. They feel so deeply connected with you and your soul family and it feels like absolute heaven on earth that they can withstand um, this this turbulence as they're moving out of the old earth to new earth. This is what you and your person are doing. It just said five, five, five. They love you completely. This is such an exciting adventure. This is what your soul's signed up for. They feel like the luckiest person in the world to be experiencing this incredible transition, metamorphosis with you. Yeah, ascension, wow, going home, ascending to the fifth dimension and beyond. So much soul growth, so much raising of the vibration, purification, reconnecting, remerging, remembering the true soul self, releasing karma through so much love. This is an absolutely incredible bond that you have. They feel insane passion for you, so much chemistry, powerful magnetism, desire, sexual union, obsession, fantasies, euphoria. They're intoxicated. They can't get enough because this is the deepest soul level fulfillment. I'm hearing it's ticking all the boxes. It's answering all the questions. It's bringing them into alignment with peace, with truth. It's you know, answering the questions, the deepest soul questions. They're so attracted to you. Intense magnetism, alignment with the truth. You are the divine masculine and feminine. This yin and yang, that which appears to be two, that is one. This is helping them understand that this is just a false matrix about the appearance of duality and separation. They're understanding they're not alone. They're not lonely. They are so connected with you and with the soul family and God and the divine and they feel euphoric. They, they're pulled into this connection. It's irresistible. It's like a moth to a flame. The flame's burning out everything that isn't true. As within, so without, and yeah, so much chemistry. This is a sacred union we have at the bottom of the deck. You may have felt, you may have both felt like the ugly ducklings, like you didn't fit in in this world, but now you are growing into these graceful swans, knowing your beauty, knowing your worth. It says twin flame soulmates, true love, the journey back to oneness, infinity, divine masculine and feminine, mirrors, balance and yin and yang. Yeah, look, we have the confidence. They have so much more self-love, self-worth. They feel deeply loved by you. Um, success, self-belief, courage, supported. They're unstoppable. They're feeling much more secure. And this is why they're opening their heart to you. Being vulnerable, surrendering, letting go of their fears, dissolving the ego, expressing their true feelings. We have this is my truth. Being authentic and courageous. Wow. This is such an intense connection. Filled with so much excitement. Yeah, look, it's absolutely intoxicating. And it's because there's all of this harmony. The yin and the yang, the perfect balance. Um, so much healing, energy, serenity, peace, wholeness. You are home to each other. You are going back home. You are sending they feel this soul bond so powerfully. This is about ascending as well. Um, rising up like these helium balloons. Helium balloons are often about celebration as well. Often have them at parties. Um, what do they want to say to you right now? 
Let me be your hero. Wow. This is six of one. Six is the number of love. This is rising up out of any struggles that have held this person back in their life to do with self-esteem, to do with the false negative self-image, the false stories in this false matrix. <clears throat> this all being replaced with the truth. Let me be your hero. This is success. This is they really want to be there for you. They really want to help you out of any struggles and um, these challenges of ascension as well. Please remain open to me. This person, they need you to be this queen of cups to their king of cups. Again, this is you both learning to open your heart. When you open your heart to this person, this just makes them feel so reassured. And in turn, they are now opening their heart very powerfully to you. So I'm going to continue this reading on in an extended reading. We're going to start off by looking at lots more messages, cards. What does your person really want to say to you right now? What do they really need you to know about their true feelings? We're also going to look at messages from spirit what does spirit need you to know about what's really going on in your union and also what is going to unfold next between you both as well so the details for the extended reading are below this video in the description box and in the pinned comments so i really hope to see you over there if this reading has resonated with you please let me know in the comments give it a thumbs up share it subscribe that all really helps me out with the algorithm thank you so much for joining me here and i hope to see you over on the extended